Hey guys, my name is Cameron and welcome to my channel. This is my first video, so please be kind and make sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more. Okay, and now that all the boring stuff is out of the way, um, it's time to make breakfast. So what I usually like to do is I just grab a bowl and I kind of like to do like fruit bowls in the morning because I feel like it's a lot easier to digest and like, you know, empty stomach. And yeah, that's just what I like to do. And you can obviously add whatever kind of fruit that you like. I just like raspberries and bananas. So let me put this down. Okay, so I already started putting my fruit and stuff in the bowl and I'll show you what that looks like. So this is kind of what we have so far. It's just raspberries, bananas, and then coconut yogurt. This is the brand that I use. The So Delicious, just coconut milk yogurt alternative, just plain. I usually do like to get the vanilla one, but they didn't have it when I went to Market Basket this weekend. Okay, so I'm gonna add the walnuts. Just like, they're like half chopped, half full pieces. Just kind of sprinkle that in there. And then chocolate chips. Right. And last but not least, honey. I got this really cute little honey jar. I got it from Marshalls. It's super cute. So I kind of just let this drizzle. You can't even really see the bowl. I'm sorry. That's, there you go. So I kind of just let that drizzle in as much or as little as I'm feeling like. And yeah. My favorite thing to do, honestly, is eat breakfast on my porch when I have the time to, so I'm going to go do that. So after I eat breakfast, I usually like to clean the kitchen or like do any dishes or anything like that, but it's pretty clean. I cleaned it yesterday, so... Don't need to do that. So we can just go straight into getting ready for the day. So I did sleep in this, but since I work from home, which I'm very grateful for, I think I'm just gonna stay in it. And I'll probably just do my makeup in my floor mirror because it's so much easier. I'm not a huge fan of the lighting in here. So we're gonna go do that. Okay, wow. I'm sorry if this is crooked. It just took me so long to set my phone up, but it's balancing on my yoga mat, so awesome. Um, so the first thing I usually really do is kind of just brush my brows with like a clear brow gel. I just use like this little like this one from e.l.f. Just from like Walgreens or something. I'm like desperately running out. There's literally nothing left in this. But it's fine, it still does the job. So I just kind of do that. It's full. And I'm not really doing like a full makeup look today, but if you guys want that, I can do that for you in a different video. Which would be fun. I'm usually very simple. I don't do I don't do eyeliner or like eyeshadow or anything like that. Props to the people that can do that because I am no makeup artist. So just concealer and then I don't even put powder over that. I kind of just Leave it just to kind of cover my bags because they're terrible. And then just 
lightly line my eyebrows. The best that I can. I always have such a hard time doing this, but it's fine. That looks fine. Sorry if I keep looking this way. It's because it's just so I'm looking in the mirror and then looking here and it's tripping me out. Um, I usually like to add a little blush. This is just the NARS blush in Luster. It's like a really pretty pink. I love it. I just put that like all over my cheekbones, really wherever. I just need some color because I'm super pale. I actually went to the beach the other day for the first time in like a year. And it was only like 70 degrees, but I still managed to get some sort of color. I usually put it on my nose too for that like sunburnt look. Okay, once that's done, I'll use this. Go Go Tint by Benefit. It's like a lip and cheek tint. And so I'll just dab that on my lips just to give it a little color. a really pretty like it looks like when you pull it out it looks like it's like a bright pink like neon pink but it doesn't turn out that way and last but not least i'll just curl my eyelashes and add some mascara i use the telescopic by l'oreal i actually just started using it because i saw maggie mcdonald using it and she's from Boston. Well, she's from Massachusetts, which is cool. Okay, this is gonna take too long. I'm gonna do the other eye off camera. Be okay, okay, so doing my mascara did take a lot longer than I expected, like always, but it's fine. Um, this is the finished look. I really like it. It's kind of just cute and simple, and it's kind of what I do almost every single day, just because it's really quick and easy and helps me feel put together. So, yeah. If you want to see, like, a full makeup routine with products and names and all that jazz, let me know and I will do a video on it. So I just realized that I never showed you guys my jewelry box. Um, let me just start off with a disclaimer to say that none of the products I'm talking about are sponsored. Um, so yeah, let's just get into it. So this is my jewelry box. Um, I got it from West Elm. It's a little bit pricey, but it's honestly, it's really great quality. I highly recommend you check it out. I can have it linked in the description box down below if you guys wanna look at that. Um, and yeah, it just holds all my jewelry. Um, it's, like I said, it's, it's just a great jewelry box, honestly. Um, and so this is kind of jewelry that I wear almost every single day. Um, I just have some gold hoops. I love my gold hoops. Um, and then these are just some rings that I wear almost every single day. Um, these two are my absolute favorite. Um, they're from Keem on Instagram. I absolutely love their company. Their quality is so good. The girls that work there are so kind. And I can also link their Instagram in the description box below if you guys want to check them out. So I really don't think I have anything else to show you guys today. Um, I'm kind of just hanging out the rest of the day. I have to work in two hours, which isn't really that exciting. So I'm sure you don't really want to see that. Um, with that being said, I think I'll end the vlog here. 
Um, I just want to say thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate the support. I really hope you guys continue on watching. I'll definitely keep making videos. Um, so just make sure to subscribe and comment. And yeah, thanks.